Don't miss a beat, join the notification squad by clicking that bell, you'll get notified every time I upload a video, and be sure to join our Discord to talk and get help with your code. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Ned. Welcome back to another episode of the Discord.js coding tutorial series. Today we're going to be doing the pay command and we're going to be jumping right into that. So basically, the pay command is just going to work exactly how you think it would. It'd be pay and I have I satisfied in my Discord to test this with and then we're going to get do it an amount. So amount of coins. So the first thing we need to do, of course, is require the coins file. So let coins, whoops, equal require coins.json. All right. And now we need to check. So basically, we want to check for this user's um, coins, and then we're going to check for the author's coins. So first, we're going to do the author. If coins brackets message dot author dot ID and then we're gonna go ahead and do some curly brackets because we want to return if there's nothing there if there's nothing there that means they don't have anything to pay with it anyways so we can just go ahead and return it here so return message dot reply you don't have any coins okay Next thing we need to do is we need to now get the coins of the person we're mentioning. So let, and we'll just call them pay user equal, sorry. <clears throat> now we just need to get the user that we are paying if this does like make it pass it. So let p user equal message dot guild dot member message dot mentions dot users dot first and then we can do or message dot guild dot members dot get args zero all right now we need to check the coins of this person so if coins p user dot id does not exist then we're going to go ahead and create it coins p user dot id is equal to coins zero all right whether that check is done we can go ahead and we can get the um both users amount so let's go ahead and do it let new well not new user um let's name them p coins just for to keep it similar coins p user dot id dot coins just to make it a little bit more simple and then um sender we'll just say s for sender coins equal coins and we'll put message dot author dot id Dot coins so we also need to get the amount of coins that this person is sending and we need to check it against the senders coins so let's go ahead and do that so if s coins is less than args zero we can go to return message dot reply not enough coins there all right so now that that is done we can go ahead and set we need to set both of them we need to subtract from the sender and then we need to add to the uh, mention user all right so it's actually whenever we send the message it's going to read it as a string so we need to parse int so we're going to do that as well here so coins whoops coins message dot author dot id is equal to coins and then we could put s coins minus parse int args zero actually args one and we need to change that up here too i believe nope 
args one is going to be the amount of coins. So, and then that is done. So we can go ahead and do it for the person who's getting the coins. So, page user. So p user dot id is equal to coins, and then we can get their coins p coins plus parse int args one. And now we go can go ahead and just output the message that it's been successful. So message dot channel dot send. We'll go ahead and do we can do message dot author has given p user or is that what we named them? Yeah. P user uh let's see sorry p user args zero or args one rather points all right and now we need to save the file so fs write file and we're going to go ahead and point it to the coins and then json dot stringify coins go ahead and comma and then error parentheses and then an error function if error console dot log error all right oops so this should be done guys let's go ahead and test this out I'm gonna go ahead and start up the bot node index.js everything loads up fine let's go ahead and pay one of our users so let me check my coins I have nine coins let me just go ahead and pay um, I satisfied nine coins oh looks like we misspelled arg somewhere let's see where that was Args, args, args. There it is. So, let's go ahead and restart that bot. Let's try again. There we go. So, I can do coins. I have zero. And once he does his, he should have nine. Or we could just check. All right, he's going to do it for us real quick. And he has nine. There it is, guys. All right, guys. This is going to be it for the pay command. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and leave that like and subscribe. If you have any questions about this, go ahead and join our Discord server. That link is going to be down below, as always. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.